Okay, I wanted to continue with a review of this, uh, my new uh, box that I've got, the TronSmart ARA X5. And again, that's an Intel uh, Cherry Trail Z8300 SOC, Atom processor. But anyway, uh, I'll show you a couple of different things. Uh, Netflix, it plays very well, plays in HD, high definition, and also I get uh, surround sound from it. But I also want to show you Kodi. Again, Kodi works very well. Now, if I go to TV, there's the guide. Switch to that. An HD channel. That switched pretty quick. So the channel changing is pretty quick. Now, I can pause it, I can play it, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to pause it right now and so that I can uh, fast forward it a little bit or rewind it, but well, in the meantime, while it's pausing, okay, here is the uh, TV guide. Okay, if you notice, it goes through October, well, October the 23rd, and today's the 11th, so that's uh, 12 days of TV guide. And again, the different, different channels it gets. Now this one, I'm using my little uh, $35 stick that's running uh, Open ELC, as I probably told you a dozen times before. Uh, that is my uh, DVR back end, and it works extremely well. Okay, now what I want to do, I want to fast forward it one step at a time. Uh, let me play it. Okay. Fast forward. Okay. It's fast forwarding 2x. All right, let's go to 4x. Uh, it looks very well. I will go to 8x. Okay, that's probably as far as I've gotten. But actually, the fast forwarding works pretty doggone good. Now, I'm about to re uh, rewind. Now, this one I'm stepping back a little bit of time. Oh, yeah. Apparently, it's changing channels. But anyway, it seems to be uh, working very well for a little uh, $150 uh, microcomputer. Now there's a couple issues that I have, which is actually a pretty major issue. Uh, and I've talked to uh, Microsoft uh, under the uh, network. I have two NAS, one Western Digital and one Synology. They do not show up under my network. It shows up as a media player, but not as a where I can uh, manipulate the files and see the files. So that is a flaw, and I'm, I'm pretty sure it's a flaw of Windows 10, because I've read a lot of reviews that uh, people have on Windows 10. It does not show it under the uh, Explore and I need that. 
uh, in order to make uh, Plex Media Server, I need that because it cannot find my tuners because it doesn't have SMB. MB server, same thing. It will not work properly because I don't have SMB. Uh, Cody works well, but uh, I use a different thing on that. Uh, also, the HD Home Run View, that one works very well on this $150 uh, micro computer. So the question is, is it worth $150? That's a good question. It does a lot of things these Android boxes does not do, but then again, it's got things that it, it does that Android does not have. Uh, but yes, as far as a media player, it plays very well. And until they get the issue of the uh, SBM or uh, SMB resolved, I cannot thoroughly test the Plex server back in or the MB server. I cannot check those thoroughly. So. That is one of the major problems so far, once they, once they correct that, and I'm sure that's a Windows 10 problem, once they uh, resolve that issue, then we'll be good to go. Okay, I hope that helps. Thank you.